Hello. Tonight we're going to read Let's Meet a Dentist. Chapter 1, 400 Teeth. Our class is on a mission. We want to find out what a dentist does. We visit a dentist named Dr. Flores at her office. I help people care for their teeth, Dr. Flores says. She tells us she sees about 20 patients every day. That's more than 400 teeth. No wonder it feels crowded in here. We ask how she cares for all those teeth. Dr. Flores takes us to an exam room. First, she puts on gloves and a mask. Those help stop germs from spreading. Dr. Flores lets Jasmine sit in the chair. It moves up and down. Do you play in the chair? asks Jacob. No, says Dr. Flores, but I'm glad you think it's fun. Dr. Flores says her helper, Pam, cleans each patient's teeth. Pam scrapes gunk off with special tools. Dr. Flores shows us a small machine she calls a slow speed. She steps on a pedal. The slow speed spins. Pam puts toothpaste on the tip. She uses it to polish the patient's teeth. Once the teeth are clean, I take a look, says Dr. Flores. Chapter 2, Attack of the Sugar Bugs. Dr. Flores holds up a tiny mirror and something she calls an explorer. These help me find cavities. Cavities are holes in your teeth, she says. She moves the explorer along the teeth. If it gets stuck in a tooth, there's a hole. She points to x-rays of teeth. They show cavities between the teeth, she explains. They also show me the parts of your teeth hidden below the gums. Do cavities really come from bacteria pooping? asks Robert. Most of us laugh. So does Dr. Flores. That's right, says Dr. Flores. Germs, called bacteria, eat food left on your teeth. They leave acid behind as a waste, like poop. The acid makes holes in your teeth. Gross, we say. That's why I tell people to brush and floss every day. Clean teeth don't have food for bacteria. She shows us a poster about keeping teeth healthy. How to keep your teeth happy. 1. Brush your teeth once after breakfast and once before bed. 2. Brush for two whole minutes. 3. Floss every night before bed. 4. Avoid sweet drinks and foods. And 5. See the dentist twice a year. When a tooth has a hole in it, I put in a filling, says Dr. Flores. She shows us white and silver fillings. The filling starts out soft. I push it into the cavity, and it hardens when it dries. Ouch, says Olivia. We give you medicine so it doesn't hurt, says Dr. Flores. In fact, it feels better. Bad cavities cause toothaches. She uses a chart to keep track of each patient's teeth. She writes how many permanent teeth young patients have. She also notes any cavities. Chapter 3. Straighten up, teeth. What else do you do? asks Ryan. I check to see if kids need braces, she says. Sometimes teeth grow in crooked or don't line up well. Then you see an orthodontist. That dentist straightens teeth with braces or retainers. Some of us can't wait to get braces. It's time to go back to school. Take good care of your teeth and they will stick around, says Dr. Flores. I have a patient who is 100 years old. He still has 28 healthy teeth. Because Dr. Flores lends a hand to make our teeth healthy, we give her a hand. The end. Hope y'all enjoyed. Special shout out to Charles and William. I love y'all. Night night.